Hi, I'm Alex Molinari. I'm with NewDent. Today I'm going to show you the NewDent Grand Marsh system. Here is a 5.1 model where you can explore a lot of the features of the system. Uh, so we have the implant driver. You can see here we have six dots. Each dot represents the flat part of the engagement part of the implant, looking to finish the implant placement in the right position. This tree reference is regarding the bone uh, implant level. So if the doctor is looking to place an implant one millimeter subcrestal, they go to the first reference, two millimeter or three millimeter. This is the area where the driver captured the implant and hold it. And this is the very solid engagement area to torque the implant down. When you put those two parts together, you can explore more about all those features. So we can see the engagement area, very solid and robust. We see where the implant is stabilized through the implant driver. And also you can explore the threads design in the bottom and the threads design in the top of the implant. We have here a coping that can be used in an open tray impression coping for mini conical abutment. Also can be used in, as a temporary coping. This is a macro model of your closed tray impression coping from the implant level with a plastic cap. Once you engage the impression inside the implant with the new driver by hand, you torque it down. You can see in the front part of the impression coping two flat areas where you, could, you can easily recognize where is the right position in your impression to replace it and in the back you see it's a rounded area so these two flat areas is to give you the reference to replace it in the right position and also we have a plastic cap that you snap on we have the angle mini conical abutment 17 degrees uh, it's easier to show the doctor how smooth this new design is. The same new driver that we use to put the occlusal screw, you can torque this abutment down. The recommendation torque is 20 newtons. And also in all these three, four abutments, we have the engagement very solid. Uh, this is the titanium coping for the mini conical abutment. Over the mini conical abutment, you have a new coping that can be used as an open tray impression coping and also a provisional coping in titanium. As a temporary, the customer can cut in these areas as they need to. And the occlusal screw we use the same Neo driver and the recommended torque is 10 newtons per centimeter. This is an abutment to do single unit screw retain with the respective coping, titanium as well. And this is the occlusal coping for mini conical abutment. This is the occlusal coping for the GM abutment. Here is the universal abutment to do cement retain or screw mentable retain. And the recommended torque is 20 newtons per centimeter with the same Neo driver. Once the abutment is placed, we are able to use a snap-on closed tray impression coping. Take the impression. And also we have the prefab plastic or acrylic cap that can be used to make a provisional restoration chair side or in the lab as well. And also all 
these screws in the abutment or the occlusal screws uh, we use the same driver it's called neo driver 